Ano? 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 Oh, I cannot see you. I cannot see me. I cannot see anyone. Haha. <laughs> oh, wait, Mia. Okay. Wait, teacher Anne. Wait, teacher Anne. Hãy subscribe cho kênh Ghiền Mì Gõ Để không bỏ lỡ những Hello. Yes. Hi. What happened to your mom's account? Your mom's account was hacked. My my mom's account has been hacked. Oh, I'm so sad. Okay, I will just send. We have seven lessons, so I will just send the lessons in your account. Your account, okay? The new account. Yeah. Okay. So I will share it to you now. Oh, is niece there? Yes. Oh, I thought me going home. Me is here and 8 p.m. He she go home. You will go home in a while. Yes. Picture today we has had free talking. Uh, you want free talking? Yes. Mm -hmm. You told me. Uh, you asked me. What do you want? <clears throat> what do you want to talk about? Oh, by the way, today is my mother's birthday. Mm, I, my birthday is on 21st of. March. Oh, wow. Okay, wait me, huh? He is at my home and in the evening, I think my city is go my, is go my home. Okay. Okay, so today it's the birthday of my mother in my country. Oh, wow. Mm. Do you know this? Yeah. What is it? I think it's co coffee or chocolate latte. Uh, chocolate latte. You want chocolate latte? You like chocolate latte? Mm, yes. But... I like my favorite drink is fruit juice. Yeah. Okay, let us have here. Uh, I will show you. Mm -hmm. Hãy subscribe cho kênh Ghiền Mì Gõ Để không bỏ lỡ những video hấp dẫn. 
chạy nên là chúng không bị à đi đi không bị nữa sau cả Today I and me have finished the exam and me stay in my home and we will we will go go to winter badminton in this evening with my friends. Wow. Yes. I think Messi is going go with me too. Okay. So we will have class with Messi at 10 p.m. Oh. Nice with Messi. Oh. I will share it to you. Let us talk with me. No, huh? Okay, so you will gonna go with your friends with me. Where are you going? Mm, I go to to sports center play badminton. You will go to badminton. Wow, that would be great. You will go to the badminton time. Okay, that's really great. Okay? okay, with okay. Me. I will share to you now. Let us stop talk about developing. Okay, let us have let us talk about money, money, money. <laughs> money, money, money. Oh yeah, wait. Tono, you want to have money in the future? Yes. Uh, you want to have a lot of money? Like money, money, money. Mm, I don't need any money at, because I think money comes, comes by happy and health. Okay, do you, do you want our topic is about money? Okay, let us free talking money and number. Okay. Do you know, uh, look at this one. These are the currency, ni ha, ni, no, ha? British, dollar, euro, yen, Swiss, rubble. It's Australian, Canadian, rupee, and yuan. Okay, this is the currency. Okay. So, my, 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 your currency is this one. Yours is dong, right? And teacher is peso. Teacher's money currency is peso. And dollar in is my. US. Yeah. In Vietnam, we uh, use the money is dong. Mm -mm. Yeah, dong. Okay. Teacher and is peso. Money is yeah, peso. Correct. Mm, yeah, peso. Okay. Like, like example, uh, one peso, I know, uh, one dollar is 57 pesos. Um, wait, wait. Um, 100, 10,000 dong, that's dong, that is 250 pesos. Mm. Okay. And we have here the currency. Oh, this is one thousand. This is pounds. This one. Pounds. That's pounds. Another is one point fifteen. One point fifteen dollar. It's cents. Fifteen is cents. Okay, pounds uh, is the money in, wait, Britain, or in UK, UK, their money is pound. In UK, their money is pounds. Okay, here.
Let us have this. Okay, what is this? Do you know this one? Mm, yes, it's camera. Okay, camera. Do you love to take pictures using your camera? Mm, no, I don't. But I use the camera one, one time. You love to take pictures using your camera. Okay. So how about this? Okay, so here we have digital camera, this one, but in, in, in today, we had new camera, the biggest one, the DSLR. Do you know ATM? Do you know the word ATM? Yeah. Oh, what is ATM? Yeah. ATM is? And like? And my name to down. ATM is like? It's like give me some money, some, uh, some cash. Mm -hmm. Okay, we have this. Okay, I have here English tests. Okay, let us talk. I have some questions. Okay, let us please listen this video. Okay, oh, with me. Uh, did you listen the video with me? I will let you listen about the video. Okay. Here comes Bob. Yeah, he wants to sell me his digital camera. Hi. How was dinner? Great. What do you have there? The best digital camera money can buy. Paul, that's the same camera you look... Why are you selling it? I have two. Cheryl gave me another one for my birthday. It's not bad. How much do you want? $250. Wow, that's a great... That's more than I want to pay. But that's less than... I can give you 200 for it. No, I need at least 245 Sorry, all I have is 210 There's an ATM, right? I could go as low as 230 but that's it. Sorry. Thanks, anyway. All right, I'll sell it to somebody else. What are you doing? You almost bought that camera yesterday for $300. You don't know how to bargain, do you? Bargain? Of course I know how to bargain. You don't know how to bargain. You could buy that camera for $230, but now it's gone. <laughs> All right, you can have it for $225. 220. 224. 221. 223. 222. Not a dollar more. I'm not selling this for less than $223. Here. Here's one dollar. <laughs> now you both get what you want. It's a deal. I'll get some money from the ATM. Great. You said I don't know.
Okay. So what do you think no they're talking about? I think they're talking about to sell the digital the new the best digital camera and hold hold one or don't want to buy pay that because it's expensive expensive because because he has two hundred ten dollars. Okay. Okay. So that's good. Okay. So they are talking here. Okay, about that. Okay, let us play the video again. Okay. He wants to sell me his digital camera. Hi. How was dinner? Great. What do you have there? The best digital camera money can buy. Paul, that's the same camera you look... Why are you selling it? I have two. Cheryl gave me another one for my birthday. It's not bad. How much do you want? Two hundred and fifty dollars. Wow, that's a great... That's more than I want to pay. But that's less than... I can give you two hundred for it. No, I need at least two forty-five. Sorry, all I have is two ten. There's an ATM, right? I could go as low as two thirty, but that's it. Sorry. Thanks, anyway. All right. I'll sell it to somebody else. What are you doing? You almost bought that camera yesterday for $300. You don't know how to bargain, do you? Bargain? Of course I know how to bargain. You don't know how to bargain. You could buy that camera for $230, but now it's gone. <laughs> All right. You can have it for $225. 220 224 221 223 222 not a dollar more I'm not selling this for less than $223 Here Here's $1 Now you both get what you want It's a deal I'll get some money from the ATM Great You said I don't know Okay, yes. Okay, no, they are talking about bargaining. What do you understand? No. Yeah. What do you understand no about bargain? Do you know the word bargain? I think Carol I think Carol Carol bought the camera with mm -hmm. one dollar and Paul and Paul has a deal oh, and have a deal and how live live the restaurant and Bob is his, his food okay so yeah so they're trying to have the bargain bargain it means you have to Get the price higher and higher. I uh, no, that is what we call as bargain. Okay, you understand? No, okay. So, yeah. teacher will ask question. Okay, okay, okay. This one, I will not let you answer the grammar because today is free talking day. Uh, what is it? 
Ah, what do you think are Paul and Cheryl doing? We are. Uh, I think in Paul and Cherry is done one by a digital camera. Yes, because um, Okay, it is. Okay, why does Bob show up? Why do you think Bob show up? What do you think? Why does Bob show up? camera. Okay, about camera because Bob wants to show about the camera. Who wants to buy? Oh no, who wants to buy the camera? Uh, Paul wants to buy my camera. Okay. And how much money does Bob want to get first? Um, I think I think it's two hundred fifty. Okay. Um. Okay. How much money does Bob, Bob want? And does Bob any uh, does Bob have any other camera? Does Bob mm, any other yeah. has other oh, camera? No, Bob has. No, no, he doesn't. Okay. Okay. Who gave Bob camera on his birthday? Who gave Bob camera on his birthday? Mm. Mm, I think... Oh. It's true. Okay. Okay. Who gave Bob camera on his birthday? Who? Who be who Bob who give Bob camera on his birthday? It is it's here. Okay. Now, does uh -huh, uh huh okay next one. In the end, how much is the camera? In the end, how much is the camera? I think it's one dollar. One dollar. <laughs> okay. Now, okay, so I have here Tono. Tono, do you often bargain when you shop? Like you will ask, how much is this? And I have this for $3 only, $4, $5. Do you have that or have you have you heard your mom is having a bargain with the, with the shop? I think it's have you heard your mom? Mm, I think sometimes. Okay, sometimes. sometimes. You have sometimes. Yes. Okay. Now, next, do you have any camera in your house? Mm. Yes, I. I take a photo by myself. 
Okay, you didn't have any camera in your in your house? Mm. No, I don't have any camera at the I I take a photo by my phone. Okay, yes. Now, do you like to own shop like this? Do you like to own shop like this? Mm, yes. Okay. So why? Why do you, what kind of shop do you like to own? Like clothes shop? Or no? Uh, shoe shop? Pet shop? Or whatever. What shop do you like? Can you ask the name, my friend? Oh. Kana, what shop do you want to to buy? I mean, what shop do you want to to, to have? Mm, I think I want to have a bookstore or bookstore or art art store. Okay, you want the bookstore or you want bookstore or you want bookshop? Hmm. You want a bookshop? Okay. Okay, next one. Okay, we have here. Okay, Tono, let us talk anything. Okay, you share me what do you want to, to learn about? Okay, tell me what do you want? I want to tell about my phone and my Okay, you tell me what do you want? Okay. Okay. Uh what do you want to buy? And the uh, holiday is an uh, example. You are going to travel. What do you want to buy as you travel? I want to buy some food or some food or a camera and some clothes. Okay. Oh, you want that. Okay, camera. Okay, what else? Uh, what is the most thought at me always telling me that she wants to travel to Switzerland or she wants to go to uh, United States or what do you think the places that you want to travel to in the future? Mm, I, in the future, I want to travel some kind of uh, country, uh, country, mm, yes, as good as Japan, uh, Korea, England. Uh, you want to travel? But, but I like to visit in Vietnam is Hanoi or Nha Trang. Okay. So in Vietnam, what do you think is the best place to travel? Da Nang, Hanoi, or Ho Chi Minh? Mm. I, I live in Hanoi, but I want to be in... You're living in Da Nang, right? And you want to travel in where? 
Okay. Okay, living in Danang and you want to travel in where? I prefer take the beach or the or the city. Okay, so you want to travel. Okay. Okay, so we got here. Uh, the, what is your most re, uh, dreamed place on uh, like Switzerland? Do you like to go to Switzerland? My dream place is a uh, has has a beach and a uh, beach pool. Okay, so what do you like it there? I I live in the city and I and sometimes I go to the beach and or countryside. Okay, you want to go to these places. Okay, so I know uh, Switzerland is a very nice place. I will show you some video, ha? Oh, wait me. Look at teacher. Uh, this is the video about Switzerland. Okay. Do you know, this is Nis' favorite, Switzerland. I will show you some video about the beautiful places in Switzerland. Okay, look at me. Donna. Ma, alam kong gusto mong matibay ako. Matibay ang katawan? Matibay ang isipan? Matibay ang kal... The turquoise lake and the neighboring Lake Tun are set amidst the spectacular mountain scenery of the Berlin Auburn. Now, the best things to do here are quite uh, simply boat rides and biking. The regular boat service links uh, all the little places around the lake on its route. From the chic resort of Interlaken on the western side to the little town of Brienz in the east. And travelling on this lake will bring you to the next destination. If you like to explore peaceful, idyllic and fairy tale villages that have lots of things to do and see, then Iselveld is almost certainly worth a visit. It's probably best known for the stunning photos taken of the castle, situated in Lake Brienz, Schloss Seeberg. This fairy tale small village is situated on the southern shore of the very beautiful lake. And it's a place that you cannot miss. Okay, look at Tono. This is a beautiful place, and uh, this is stunning lakes in Switzerland. This is one of the beautiful places in Switzerland. I've shown this to you already. Okay, look at this one. I will show you first. The beginning only. <laughs> Can you relate? You've Googled everything, trying to find the best ways to teach your kids math, but your kids just aren't interested. Okay, look at the it's trees, towns, up, its lakes, lakes, and its mountains. Right? So let's take a look at 25 oh beautiful places to visit in Switzerland. Really a beautiful place. 
Ah, uh, this is Switzerland. You will also see rugged cliffs and the rivers originating from the melting glacier. So Lauterbrunnen remains beautiful throughout the year, whether it's winter or summer. And the easiest way to get there is either boarding a flight to Bern or Zurich, and then later getting a train ride via Interlaken and to reach Lauterbrunnen. Lovatono is a very beautiful place. You can see there's a waterfall here, and these are the city. It's not actually a city, it's some kind of a town, but it's a very nice one. Oh my god, look at that! Can you see the village? that you can only dream of and one of the most fascinating places to visit in Switzerland. It's the perfect destination, especially for those who like more adventurous activities, luxurious hotels and being around nature. It's both wonderful in the summer as well as the winter and all of this have made Grindelwald village a haven. And you can visit Lauterbrunnen in just one day, as well as Grindelwald, as long as you're not planning to go up any other side trips, like hiking up the mountains. Number three, Bengen. Situated at the foot of the Jungfrau mountain, this traditional car-free resort town boasts breathtaking views, warm locals, delicious food, and access to some of the country's most wonderful nature. You can hike through the green hills in the spring, you can mire the valleys in the summer, and enjoy skiing and other sports in winter, making Bengen a really interesting town and an amazing holiday destination all year round. And the difference between Wengen and Lauterbrunnen is that Wengen is perched on the mountainside with views of the mountain and valley, whereas Lauterbrunnen sits in the valley. But if you want to base yourself, maybe Wengen is slightly busier, but it has more accommodation and dining opportunities. Number four, Lake Zialbsi. Now this is one of the most beautiful lakes in Switzerland. It can be found in the Alpstein region of Appenzell. The ease of accessibility and the moderate incline make it one of the most popular attractions in the Appenzell region. So it's easily searchable on Google Maps as you'll see a paved road almost the whole way. But you can really spend a whole day here or you can just be admiring the lake as you pass through. Number five, Spies or Spiers. Nestled between the hills and the vineyards and dominated by a magnificent castle, Spiers on Lake Tun is an inviting destination that you should try the next time you visit Switzerland. Here you can hike through the hills or take a long boat ride on the Blue Lake and sample some of the freshest fish. So if you travel simply just for the cuisine alone, it's a destination with an impressive offering of plenty of good food and the opportunity to taste the local wine. So I'm sure there will be plenty of wine tours on this trip as well.
Number six, Montreux. Located on the beautiful shores of Lake Geneva, Montreux epitomizes tranquility and the natural beauty that surrounds it. Now I think this is an incredibly pretty town that is often referred to as the Swiss Riviera. So it's kind of no surprise that many famous artists, writers and travelers have frequented this inviting lakeside town in the past. It's home to stunning historical architecture and there are plenty of activities all year round from either skiing and snowboarding in the winter to hiking and biking in the summer. Number 7. Lake Briens. The turquoise lake and the neighbouring Lake Tun are set amidst the spectacular mountain scenery of the Bernese Oberland. Now the best things to do here are quite simply boat rides and biking. The regular boat service links all the little places around the lake on its route. From the chic resort of Interlaken on the western side to the little town of Briens in the east. And travelling on this lake will bring you to the next destination. If you like to explore peaceful, idyllic and fairy tale villages that have lots of things to do and see, then Iselveld is almost certainly worth a visit. It's probably best known for the stunning photos taken of the castle, situated in Lake Briens, Schloss Seeberg. This fairy tale small village is situated on the southern shore of the very beautiful lake, and it's a place that you cannot miss. Matterhorn. This is a mountain of the Alps, straddling the border between Switzerland and Italy. It's known internationally by its German name, the Matterhorn, and owes its fame to the almost perfect pyramid shape. Its four-sided rigid rocky peak towers over 4,000 meters above sea level. So this is just a beautiful view of the mountain. Number 10, Lutri. A medieval market town that yes. is home to an 11th century this church is one in of a 16th the century castle. Uh, places in Switzerland, okay? So, uh, by the way, Donna, tomorrow, what time we're going to have class? 5 p.m.? I think it's 10 a.m. Oh, sorry, sorry, 10 p.m. Okay, I will see you at 10 p.m. tomorrow. And you want free talking again? Okay. <laughs> okay. Thank you. Okay. See you tomorrow. Bye bye. <laughs>